What's up guys, today we are gonna take a look at the Chi from ZGRT. This is an amazing undersized yo-yo that's H-shaped, freaking looks sick, and plays even better. Let's check it out. All right guys, so here is the box, standard ZGRT box. We got the pink, black, galaxy colorway. And you can see the yo-yo is um, spelled Q-I, but it's pronounced Chi, as far as I know. And we got a pretty cool string in here. Heck yes. ZGRT, very cool. I can go in the tackle box or toolbox or something. The microwave, I'll find something for that. Uh, and then this colorway is freaking sick. As you can see, it's uh, slightly on the smaller side and it is very H-shaped. Um, I like smaller H-shaped areas. I've never really been a huge fan of like really big H-shaped areas, but I really like smaller H-shaped areas. I've always thought they were just cool. Um, and you know, it's not, this isn't that small. I mean, when you compare it next to like this yo-yo, you know, it's definitely smaller, but it's not like, it's not like a mini yo-yo by any means or anything, you know. But I must say, these col this color is awesome. Um, they make, you know, several other really cool colors. You can see, like, we get the little Chi logo there. Lots of cuts in it, and just overall very, very cool shape. Here's the guts. So we got a concaved bearing. Um, we got a hardened steel black axle uh, that's good the those are less likely to strip or anything um always big fan of that and we got these really cool black pads i don't know if i've ever had a yo-yo with black pads in it i mean i'm sure maybe i have but off the top of my head i cannot think of one um but overall just very very cool as far as the overall shape size colorway everything about it just looks very very cool so yeah i mean not much really that I can say without playing with it. So let's do that. You can see here the fat thumb grind lip. I mean, it looks like you'll be able to finger spin in that little nub there. I'm just overall very, very fun. Looks like it'll be a really fun area to play with. So throw a string on it and uh, have the fun. All right, let's see what Chi has got. Hopefully it's better than my jokes. And so far it is. <laughs> Uh, right away, I'm liking the diameter for like these chopstick tricks. It's fitting really well between my thumb uh, and my index finger, which I really enjoy. First bind felt really nice. Okay, even though it's only like 62 grams, uh, it actually spins really well because it's H-shaped. Um, there's a lot of rim weight still to it. Response feels really good. I like these black pads. Um, I think I like them more than just because they're black, but regardless, I like them a lot. <laughs> well, 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 there we go. <laughs> yeah, quite forgiving too. I had a pretty bad bind there. Still able to just throw it out. Yeah, because it's slightly undersized, things like little regens like that are really gonna help out a lot. Now this is not that small. I mean, it's still very easy to whip, and uh, there's nothing like, it's really harder to do on it. It's not to that point where it's like a small mini yo-yo or anything. It's just a little smaller diameter than your average competition yo-yo, which I personally prefer. I mean, I, I really like that. You know, I like yo-yos that are medium size-ish, you know, medium to the medium smallish. They're kind of my favorite, but unless I'm doing 5A, then I want a little bigger, but. For me, so far this feels really good. Let's try out that little finger spin dimple. It's got quite the nice little impression there. Oh yeah, and it actually finger spins really well. Yeah, and the binds feel great. Like I, I'm getting these super tight binds um, with these black pads. Could be because they're brand new. Could all be in my head. I don't really know. <laughs> okay, yeah, quite stable too, even on stuff like this. It really, I mean, it feels light as far as like how fast it plays and stuff, but at the same time, it feels slightly heavier in all the good ways. Like it carries momentum, it's nice and stable, it's nice and rim weighted, and it just, you know, it feels powerful, you know, in a very good way. And this finish on here is phenomenal. Like this finish feels so good. A lot of times you'll get a yo-yo and the finish might be awesome, but the yo-yo doesn't like look that cool or the yo-yo looks really cool but it doesn't perform as well on things like grinds and stuff. This is both. Like, it looks freaking sick as hell. 
and it grinds really, really good. Um, it also has that massive thumb grind lip, so if that's something you're into, um, yeah, like, no problem. Like, I probably go all the way around. Boom. Yeah, baby. <laughs> no problem. Let me, uh, adjust my tension a little bit. That stupid DNA trick always messes up your tension. But the kids want to see it, so we always do it. Or at least recently, we do. <laughs> but yeah, very predictable. Overall, just really fun yo-yo. Um, not really a yo-yo that takes any getting used to. Um, kind of feels really natural. Yeah, can't go wrong with this. Boom. Boom. Yeah, really digging everything about it, to be honest. Oh, that was me. Stupid hat. This trick is kind of hard with the hat because my the string in my right hand always gets caught on the bill, but somehow, somehow we made it work. Yeah, but I just absolutely love this finish on this thing. It is just incredible. And it's got this really cool, like, I mean, you know, it. It's really cool looking when it's not spinning, but then when it is spinning, too, it's just like one solid, really nice purple color. Um, and I have checked out several of their other colors online, and there's a lot of cool colorways to this. So like, this isn't the only super awesome one. There's a lot of colors. You might want to pick up a couple of these things. And I like that it is a mono metal that's, you know, affordable, but really, really kills it. Like, so far, there's not really anything bad I can say about this, to be honest. Yeah. So this yo-yo just came out, I believe. Oh, I got a fake knot. Come on. There we go. <laughs> um, yeah, this yo-yo just came out, I believe. And, uh, yeah, I would definitely pick one up, I think. This is one of the best mono metals to come out in a while, especially mono metals on the slightly smaller side. So if you're somebody like me, and you really enjoy yo-yos that are not freaking so huge that you're always hitting extra strings and stuff, definitely check this out. And it's just a little unique, you know? It's, it's, it's got this nice eight shape. There's all these freaking cuts in it on both... The inside here as well as the outside and this thumb grind lip is just absolutely massive which also helps it carry more rim weight um as well as i really like the the little groove they have for the finger pin uh the, the finger spin it really locks in there right in place and it's you know along with the nice finish um it feels great and that little laser etching on there is also super smooth i'm not feeling that at all when i do anything so um i can't recommend this enough i would definitely check this thing out um yeah Definitely gets my stamp of approval. So thank you, ZGRT, for sending me this. Um, yeah, and we got Thanksgiving coming up, guys. So everybody, hopefully you have a safe, happy Thanksgiving. Be careful driving out there. Roads are starting to get bad, especially in my area. So if they are by YouTube, make sure to stay safe on the road out there. And uh, yeah, have a happy Thanksgiving. And I'll see you guys soon. Later.